वेलकम टू द अनदर वीडियो ऑफ क्रिकेट थ्रिल मुजाहिद जमशेद बॉर्न ऑन दिसंबर 1, 1971 एट मुरीद के पंजाब ही वाज अ फॉर्मर पाकिस्तान क्रिकेटर हु प्लेड फोर ओडीआईज इन 1997 ही वाज राइट हैंडेड मिडिल ऑर्डर बैट्समैन व्हेन ही वाज कॉल्ड इनटू द स्क्वाड एंड मेड हिज डेब्यू ड्यूरिंग द 1996 97 ओडीआई ट्रायंगल टूर्नामेंट इन ऑस्ट्रेलिया Unfortunately his ODI career lost only 11 days because he made ODI debut on January 7 1997 against Australia at Hobart and he was last played against West Indies at Sydney on that tour on January 18 1997 he represented to the Pakistan in four ODIs and out of the three innings he made only 27 runs and 23 was is the highest score He played 127 first class games and scored 6376 runs with the highest score of 196 at an average of 32.20 including 1629 50s in a list a career he's played 84 matches and scored 1820 runs 128 not out was his highest score at an average of 23.33 with the help of 1950s On his ODI debut, Mujahid Jamshed came on number 6 and scored 23 runs from 46 balls with the help of two boundaries. This was his highest score. He was extremely talented batsman and scored a lot of first class runs, but he could not return back to the Pakistan team. Okay, fast up uh, the ball with the three, but for the shot happy with two. Mushahid Jamshed is uh, off the mark. It would be a great relief for him to make his debut in Limited Rovers Internationals. Great shot for four. We haven't seen much of him, but uh, that's true. He looks as though he can play. Yes, this is uh, Mujahid Jamshed. And uh, it is a lovely shot. Have another look at this. It was uh, just over pitched a little bit outside the off stump and he really went after it. And again, he's got a lot of bat on that one too. So a couple of lovely cover drives from the uh, batsman out there at the moment. Jamshed playing that one. Wasim played the other one. Christopher Strader. Don't see him miss too many. Or struggling, possibly through a slightly late start there. Didn't seem to push off as quickly as uh, he might have wanted. That may be shown up by the replay. Would have been a good catch this one. He goes for it. He has to go for it. They've got that staggered format there. And it's in the air, right? It's a catch. And uh, let's have a look at it. Did it drop a little bit? It did. Yes, and he got a fingertip to it. He, yeah, it was a, it was a pretty tough. Beautifully struck, right up the middle. We haven't seen a lot of uh, Mujahid Jamshed. I'll tell you one thing we can uh, tell you about him is that he can hit the ball very hard. Beautiful off drive here. Not much more than a short arm jab, not a big flourish of the bat. Very wristy in stroke play. cocking the wrist very very risky there but he generates enormous power beautiful piece of timing and placement that's well played because he was looking to come forward that wasn't all that short and he was very quickly in the position excellent shot very effective stroke against uh, fast medium bowlers Look to go forward, force the bowler into dropping it short. Blewett must have sensed he was looking to get on the front foot. Just a bit, drops it short, and then pushes off the front foot, rocks back onto the back foot four. We have a safe could go towards the third man. Better come out. McGrath coming around, dives, good save. 
Bradley with a couple. Looks well as well, this big crowd. No, the Brent McGrath's having a big year for Australia. Appreciate that great effort, third man. Man has only just come back uh, with a knee injury. That was a pretty good performance. And then we know he has a, a good throwing arm. It doesn't always happen that it whips back over the bales. That one did. It's nice. He chipped away at uh, backward square leg. This pair batting very sensibly. And like all the good Pakistan players, very risky and good timers. They're normally brought up on decks that stay low in Australia, but on this quicker pitch, they're timing the ball well. A 50 run partnership has been one of uh, courage and certainly uh, talent. This is nicely whipped away. The wrist there flicked it away back with a square. His 10th uh, over has 2 for 17. That's out! He's got 3 for 17. Just hitting it straight down the throat of Stephen Moore. Pickle having a great day. Bowling superbly. Certainly is good performance from him. It'll catch the eyes of the selectors and confirm what they already thought they knew. It's uh, just got him with one that's moved away and bounced a little extra. That is a good blow for Andy Bickle. He's your head champ shed. Steve Walpole Bickle for 23. It's 5 for 78.